Hi guys, welcome back again to another session. In this session, we'll be learning about a few interesting topics, like a few small topics, but a very interesting topics like assignment rules, auto response rules, and escalation rules. So, what are these things? Assignment rules. What it does is it assigns based on a rule. So basically, assignment rule is only for lead and case. So based on a criteria. So whenever a cri criteria is there, based on that criteria, it will assign those particular records to leads which are based on from leads and cases and you have auto response rules as the name suggests it will automatically respond to the criteria based on a criteria it will automatically responds it will also work for lead and case as well you have escalation rule basically what is escalation rule is that you know whenever the it will only work for case because escalation like you are escalating to the next level whenever you're not satisfied with whatever the pro solution that you file a case for and you're not happy with that particular solution, you escalate to the manager. Say example, you have given your car to a service and you're not happy with the service. What you do is you'll escalate to the manager. You talk to a manager or the concerned head of the team to discuss about what your issue is, why it does not resolve. So let's take a first look into what, what all these things are, how do you do, what all, what all things can be done there. And then we'll later on make a note of everything. So how to go to assignment tool, just click on setup. You get your quick find box here and you just type in here assignment and as you can see you have lead assignment rule and case assignment rule as i've told you it will only work for two things leads and cases so let's say we'll be working on leads so it will be similar for the cases as well there is already a standard rule here just click on it you can see there are two rules which already there okay so this is a rule name so if you want to create something custom you can click on new but if you're creating a new one, the uh, standard rule will be deactivated automatically. Say example, you're trying to, uh, rule name would be, uh, let's say, I put it in test itself. I'm activating it, I'm saving it. See, as soon as it is activated, the standard rule has been deactivated. So wh what all things can be done? You can write number of rules here. See rule criteria, you click on new, you can add a criteria, sort order, you have to give it an order, see what it is. Say so evaluates each rule based on the order, like nothing. Right, my bad. So basically your order should be one, two, three, four. Which rule should be fired first, which rule would be fired second. So based on the criteria, or you all you will also have formula if you want to have a formula. And then you have a user which you want to assign it to. Based on the users, you other you can assign it to any person. Say for example, you are working in offshore team, you know you are working in an offshore team and there's an on onshore team as well whenever a client is uh, which is related to us all right is trying to create a, a lead or something it should be assigned to the us people not that it, if someone is having an issue or if something is assigned there it should not be assigned to someone who's working in india right so you can say that whenever you can you know let's say we have a, we can create i think so we created any fields here no we didn't create any fields in the leads right any which way we have a country field when a current user country equals india or us assign it to people from there if you have any template you can actually use a template as well or else now let's go to this is about the assignment rule so it will be the same for the case as well Let, let's also take a look at what would it look like case assignment rule see it will be the same thing i'll show it for the standard and see hey, the order would be one two three four five six so on okay if you want to add any in the stand new in you want to add any rule criteria and then the standard you can also add it or else you want to create something out of the box you can create it by clicking on new let's take a look at auto response see it will also work for lead and the case so i'll show you it on the lead so that you can replicated for the case as well click on new give it a rule name activate and then click again here see everything would be the same thing but here you see previously we, we didn't had this one we had an email template here which is not mandatory but here you see email template is mandatory Wait, what, what basically what it is it is an automatic it is an auto response rule basically it will respond automatically to your rule based on your criteria 
the criteria as as i told you you can select it based on your business scenario you have a lot of uh, fields over here based on those fields or based on your business scenario you can write a criteria and you can you know write in a name here and an email address this would be the sender's email address an email template how do you create an email template you go to the classic email template you can create a template based on the scenario all right let's move on to the escalation rule now see it it is only working for cases i've clicked on it you also have a standard one let's look at the standard one see you have a lot of this thing you have eight different rule entries here what it is saying account billing country equals us us usa united states united states of america and account sla equals platinum and case equals nine then you perform something you can edit it if you want to just to make sure what what they have written see escalation 2 hours or 0 minutes assign it to harsha reddy if it's going beyond 2 hours you assign it to harsha reddy uh, let's take a look into this one what it is saying it is giving us 6 hours see when equals this one okay when a case is created how to escalate timer 6 hours if it's beyond 6 hours you can assign it to harsha reddy like here we everything is based on harsha reddy because he is the only user here in this organization whereas when it comes to the real time you'll be having multiple users so based on your time frame you know the assign assigning would be changing let's take a look at the third one as well now see this is on four hours basis so basically based on the criteria and everything you can you know escalate uh, assign it to a different person all right see there's also template support escalate case notification it's it, it's it's asking us for 12 hours so this is about these three rules now let us make a note of all these things first one would be assignment rule auto response so what is auto response automatically replying and what else we have we have escalation it will be only it only like it will it will only work for cases whereas this will work for lead and case simultaneously let's copy everything here auto response will also work for lead and cases all right so this is about the assignment rule the order response rule and escalation rule so your uh, assignment rule can rules can be used in various formats as well say example if you've created a lead and you're not available you can assign it to the other colleague of yours so that you know he can do a follow-up on it as well so based on the scenarios based on your you know business requirements you can tune your assignment rules auto response rules and escalation rules escalation rule basically escalating the case if the if the customer or the client is not happy with whatever the solution you provided he'll escalate it but based on the time frame as well it will be working auto response rule will automatically respond based on the criteria whenever the criteria is there it will try to send you send an email say say example for example uh, if there is a lead which needs to be called back to further inform him about the data and you have forgotten it you can automatically send him a you know, what do you say an email stating that sorry for the inconvenience that i'm unable to call you at this point of time i'll call you back in xyz hours so you can use all these different rules based on your criteria and make your work pretty easy all right so this is about the rules right now 
So we'll be, get back in the next section again. Till then, bye-bye, guys.